الشرف تا مامور كسكول كرجال ترمان الثاني سكار موجور هي برنس بلك أنا عبد القادر ظاهر عبد الله والدين تي أرد هذا كل يوم وحنا بسلام يا سلامة إسلامك السلام عليكم ورحمة الله وبركاته ما أنت واحد كسكس دم الله واحد في لدود ومدو كوضعي تهاي قل شبس كا جلاس كسدي لا 2013 2014 يا سكول كرجاسر ماذا سارس أكاريبي أو تمجرس ذي والله هذا الدوانا إن شاء الله عبد القادر باك هذا الدوانا يو مذاح ذكلا تقول لما ربنا كل يا رادو حد الناس إذا عاد جاء هاي مسلم هذا مال سكوت ما ذو حلقو فراي ذا قرانك ما توه حد ديارنا شيخ محمود شيخ علي حسن جزان سودو شيخ محمود أعوذ بالله من الشيطان الرجيم الله لا إله إلا هو الحي القيوم لا تأخذه سنة ولا نوم له ما في السماوات وما في الأرض من ذا الذي يشفع عنده إلا بإذنه يعلم ما بين أيديهم وما خلفهم ولا يحيطون بشيء من علمه إلا بما شاء وسع كرسيه السماوات والأرض ولا يؤده حفظهما وهو العلي العظيم يا أيها الذين آمنوا اتقوا الله ولتنظر نفس ما قدمت لقد واتقوا الله إن الله خبير بما تعملون ولا تكونوا كالذين نسوا الله فأنساهم أنفسهم أولئك هم الفاسقون لا يستوي أصحاب النار وأصحاب الجنة أصحاب الجنة هم الفائزون لو أنزلنا هذا القرآن على جبل لرأيته خاشعا متسدعا من خشية الله وتلك الأمثال نضربها للناس لعلهم يتفكرون هو الله الذي لا إله إلا هو عالم الغيب والشهادة هو الرحمن الرحيم هو الله لا إله إلا هو الملك القدوس السلام المؤمن المهيمن العزيز الجبار المتكبر سبحان الله عما يشركون هو الله الخالق البارئ المسور له الأسماء الحسنى يسبح له ما في السماوات والأرض وهو العزيز الحكيم هذا يوم ماسني يا شيخ محمود شاء على حسن جسان الله نوافعه نحدنا واحد سودو إن شاء الله جلاس كوجو دنيس نورد أمريكا وجونو ده ده ير وسكن جريد يا معلم كودي شيف يا مدينو أو نوقع الدور على الوضع على إن عالم كأمريكا يا عالم كصومالي سودو مستر شيف بيوم ماسين في الثانوي، شيف يمدينه، حاولوا ذك بسواق تين، 
أدنا واحد ربعنا سوده ويو سكول بورد شركة بروجستر من ماد ساينس أكاديمي شيخ علي سوده وش علي وعربا مانتا إلى أن أشهدوا أن دتك والدين تأمشي مدي أهل هذا يوم عرفت يا قرابة كلو صار عضي يا دتك كمونتيجا هجامية أهل كان شو جمانتا أنا أشهد إسكول كان هل ككلية وكوجول يستي أن مانتا هر كان شوقنا أن كوجارنا إنا يتاي وذا شقين توالدك إيو أن جورنا قانا أرد جا إيو والدك بوحي دون يان هذا ربط إنا الدولة ما أنت هل قف دولتك لك حاجة إيمانا يا معدك لك حاجة إيمانا يا إن أتصور لو يسوي حظ بحنت هاي إن أتقول قل يسوي هي أذا هاك نبت قل يذا هي أذا هاك إنفورميشن كا هي أذا هاك ماركت يا محو هاي سياسة ده هي أذا هاك دبلوماسية ده أدي جذاه تاي هدي دبده هتابع أدي دبده تاي سادو أوجاتو قف كان دغن كيسة وحو تعلي هاي قاب كأوها بونا تصور لو ينكرت مارك وحو أن أنا جا إسكول كان وحو نقرنا أو أنجوش أنجو قارنا وحو تاي أرد جا مركو نوعي ما هذا وحنا أجنا فمل كوكي مذي على إسك سارن دغن كأوية أو 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 ليه هاي وحنا نقد دونا فمل كو هي وحنا أرد جو نقد دونا يو صباح دي مركي إسكول كي ما هذا وحنا لا كل مان برنس بالكو إريد كتاعن إفيرن هاي موت كو سدوي هاي سد أي حالة ضد أوتاي وجه فرن هي قلب فرن كسر دوين هاي وحنا كلون ما رت يا وأنا أقول لك أن هذا المشروع كان يحصل على المشروع الذي 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 يحصل مرك واحد ربعنا نقدر به أن عبد القادر ظاهر أو أبرس بقول كيسقول كه إن أنا واحد يرن كي رادو عبد القادر واحد وهذا كي سقول كان مارت يا فكر كيس لها أبا بولي ما كان كليه جارت هذا سقول هذا يكوي على رجتر أما مارت كوي على محوهاي تو أن من يابلس أما 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 مارت سمبول ماله بكوي على تذكي كف كي رايوي ما كلي أنت استديك كله أيها هوسي ماذا إسكول كان أم بإسكولات كعبد القادر أو رنجريو أيها هوسي ماذا مركز إن شاء الله أسيء ركلو ساعة بديسة وحيكون فكران إن إسكول كان لقفره مجال ذان وأنا وأنا نصيبه يا لني وحن أمس أنا هاي أدي بورك أنا هذا كهلا هاي بورك وحواي ما ملك قلها ما ملك إسكول كوي إسكول كان مركز قلها ما ملك إسكول كيا وحن لقى هلا ده أنا هاي إسكول كيا في جرك وحن عبد القادر كو أمانة يا أو رنتي هرتي إنك شيء جيا بار أنت جاي أرضا ذا إيه مارتيا أنت أهلو قرابة ذا كم بالك معاه تو سكول كجوجو قرابة ذا مارتيا إن أرضا ذا إيه مارتيا واردين تا إنه وياهينن هلا بورا أو هلاذيا وحلا بهاي هاي ما أمركم بهاي ذا أرجنا إنك كسي فكرنا وحنا نكسي فكرنا شان سنو لحسن أو دمن سكول كان بلان بلان كيس ما قرشي سفك أيان ومارتيا أو أو نصهر دجا طب إذا نمارتيا هذي معلن وحلا برا هاي أي تاي مثل غادا هاي أي تاي وحلا جدا يا سيد بسسك وكلي أدون كأي تاي أرد هذا كروكلون كود هذا أي تاي يا وحكة هذا أي تاي أسيق على كهرة يا باهدا أنت أن لو جانين أيو نصو قدما أنا قلنا ماركت يا محوها وحن ماركت يا قنيك كدوجنا وح باهيا وأنا أرجنا إن أي صحة هاي أسيق ونوجه جامنا إن شاء الله وح ربنا هاد لا That is why our school will go to the. I had the in over seven years in our market here transportation and see no other babur the other bus car or subway so so that you know so we didn't share that like bus car or subway so so that school at Kerala here in the market transportation I think I'm not in a hell big race in I think I'm not market of an. Thank you. What I call on the issue here. سند والبوحة إريد كنوس ورا نوضة ما أركتان أما الله سعتان إن ما أركت يا مركان امتحان هذا قادم أنا الجواب في عن الأساسي اللي يرادو إسقولات كفي عن بعض أقول رئيسين أما أتكمتين أما وحان الله أما وحان كلون الله سيا فينانشال ما أركت أول ديبان الله سيا مركا سند والبا وحوا يدول دوحة نسيسا أما وسائر دوحة نوجي ماذا أما هي أذا سر دوحة نوجي ماذا أبا المرين لشيء جاي إسقول كونه وناكسين يا وليب إسقولات كونه وناكسين أو أقول رئي
وأنا أقول لك أن أنا 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 معلنكي كعانك وحان كبر النبي صعب هذا لو قدر جا مركب وحان الرباع ولا ذا هير حمر كهون ذاك هير كوفر كان سدي منه وحيد هذا واحد واحد سين من كيس قاصتي وحان الرباع مركب هذا نقول فرح صناعي سدا وحود عين سدا وحيين وحان يدي شيء جا إن سكول كان وو تجي وهر مري امتحان هذا يوح برشة أنا ماشوا كمرة إلا أك وحان الرباع مركب هنا كسور دويو أنا برنسيبل كي أنا هذا أنا كان لاي عبد القادر إذا أنا كسر دوايا ربا I wanted to call the one of the innovators for this school and charter the school in 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 Minnesota and his good leader and principal of the school عبد القادر داهر عبد الله welcome today we have a guest here. Former Senator Amber, she was one of the architects in 1991, putting the legislators in front of them to open the charter schools. So she was one of the architects. She is our keynote speaker today. So keep in mind, listen to her. It took a time. It was a tough day that day when she came up with the idea of putting the charter school movement in place. I am very delighted to be here today. It's a day that all of us will remember. It's a graduation for our eighth graders. It's June 2nd, 2014. First of all, I have to mention Senator Ember, the board members, the parents, the teachers, and the support staff, and the graduates of 2014. We welcome you in helping us celebrate the success of the eighth grade graduating class of 2014. We would like to thank everyone involved in helping us, these students to the Strymont Place. I, as your principal, I am overjoyed at seeing you graduate. You are all equipped with the tools to succeed in high school and then into the colleges of your dreams. No matter where you go and what you do, there are challenges ahead in front of you. There are barriers in front of you. What I'm asking from each of you is to meet those challenges straight on with your head held high, not down. It's not enough to simply try to get by in life. That doesn't move the world forward. You must try to excel in everything you do. Strive for excellence in every task, large or small. Also, it might not be easy to see every accomplishment you achieve is added to the world's accomplishments. Your individual success benefits society as a whole because when you succeed, you lighten the burden on your fellow man. When you succeed, you are in a position to give rather than take. The wise philosopher Aristotle once said that the roots of education are bitter, but the fruit is sweet. Education takes hard work and dedication. Success doesn't occur without work. If you don't try yourself and work hard, you will never succeed. When you are learning, it's tough time. You have to spend many hours in reading, many hours on the computer to do research. Education takes hard and education. Success does not occur without the work. You all have worked very hard to get to this point. And I would hope you would continue with the same dedication and hard work with everything else you choose to do in life. I have faith that you will all succeed in high school. You have achieved a lot more than you thought you could do. Today, you passed another checkpoint. 
on your road to success. That, that checkpoint is eighth grade. However, your journey going forward will give you more challenges. You will encounter so many problems in your life. You have to face the risks. If you don't take the risk, you will never succeed. You will never prevail. So think about it. All the steps you are taking. Whenever you encounter a problem, take five minutes and think about it. Yeah. Don't be emotional because you are going to the second level of education, which is high school. <laughs> However, your journey going forward will give you more challenges, but with perseverance and positive attitude, anything is possible. Thank you very much. And now I would like to invite Senator Ember, former senator. She has been in Minnesota legislature for 18 years, and she is the one who made the charter school movement happen. And she is with us today. Senator Ember, welcome. Thank you. What a glorious day. Thank you for allowing me to be part of this, Mr. Abdallah. I so appreciate this invitation. Congratulations, class of 2014. Woo! I just toured your school and it's wonderful. I love the energy and the passion and you made me feel so welcome. Thank you all, I so appreciate that. Yes, great school. Now what I love about all of you is that you chose this school. You knew what you wanted and then you achieved your goal by graduating today. Not everyone gets to choose a school like this. Not everyone gets to attend a charter school like this. In fact, only on average, 5% of the public school students attend a charter school. You are in that very special 5%. And you know, it took great courage to start a charter school. The founders had to go through a lot of that hard work, and you all know one of the founders was Mr. Abdallah, right? And next year, yes. And next year, can you believe this is going to be your 10th anniversary? Oh my goodness, congratulations. That is so remarkable because charter schools have only been around for 22 years. So you've been there for half of them. Well, as Mr. Abdallah told you, I am the Minnesota State Senator who authored the first charter school law in Minnesota and the nation. That was back, oh, thank you. You're so kind. And that was back in 1991. You see, I am old. That was back a long time ago. Well, charter schools are created every year because ordinary people like you and me took an extraordinary stand for change. And today, there are over two and a half million students attending 6,500 charter schools in 42 states and the District of Columbia. How about that? Thank you for being a part of the charter school movement. So now let's talk about you, the graduates. There's an old Chinese proverb, learning is like rowing upstream. Not to advance is to drop back. So what does that mean? Imagine you're in a canoe and you're rowing up a stream and the current is coming at you and you gotta keep rowing and rowing. And rowing upstream is hard. And if you stop rowing, what happens? You fall back, right? So you have to keep on rowing. That's what that proverb says. So now you're graduating the eighth grade and what is next to advance up the stream? High school. And what is next after that? College, right? 
Learning is lifelong. We are always rowing upstream. We are always setting up new goals. And I know you're going to continue to do that. Now, sometimes it's hard. I'll admit, there were classes I didn't like in school. And sometimes you don't achieve as well as you want to. And the challenges are there and the barriers are there. But I want you to know that some very important people in our world and in our country have had very rough beginnings, but have persevered and persisted and gone on to greatness. One of my favorites is this. It's a man who used to be, who is an artist. He's a cartoonist. And he went around to many newspapers many years ago and wanted to be hired as a cartoonist. And a newspaper hired him and then fired him because they said that he didn't have any good ideas and he wasn't a very good artist. And so what did he do? He didn't give up. He went to a church and they needed a newsletter. So he began to write their newsletter. And they gave him an office and the only office he had was a garage. But the garage had mice in it. So he would watch the mice run around while he wrote his newsletter. Do you know who that person was? <laughs> that person was Walt Disney. Yeah. You've all heard of Disneyland, right? That person persisted. And do you know where he got his idea for Mickey Mouse and Minnie Mouse? from the mice in the garage. That was Walt Disney. So he kept going, and in the end, he achieved greatness. He didn't give up, he was persistent, he took risks, and most of all, he believed in himself. There's many other people who have done that, and you can do the same thing if you believe in yourself. Yes. You see, the founders of this charter school, all of them knew that. They achieved greatness and they have changed the lives of students for nearly 10 years. They didn't give up. They were persistent. Even though some people in the community did not agree. Even though there were people who opposed the charter school to open. Well, the same thing happened for me in the state legislature. There were lots of people who didn't think this was a good idea. They did not like this idea of charter schools. And sometimes they said bad things about me and the idea. And you know what? I almost quit. I almost quit. What would have happened if I had quit and my colleagues had quit? There might never have been this charter school. But these people continued to work together with me, and we were committed to create the charter school law, and together we pushed forward, and we rode upstream, right? We rode up that stream, and we created the charter school law. Henry Ford, of course, he's the inventor of the automobile, right? Henry Ford once said, if you think you can, or you think you cannot, you are always right. Think about that. If you think you can, you're right. If you think you cannot, you're right. Franklin D. Roosevelt's wife, Eleanor Roosevelt, one of our presidents and his wife, used to say, you can't make me feel inferior without my consent. In other words, you can't make me feel bad if I don't agree with that. Well, sometimes the biggest thing holding us back in our own minds is telling us we can't do it. Thank goodness the founders of your school didn't let that happen no matter how difficult the journey was. Maybe a few months ago, you watched the, the Olympics with me. The Paralympics followed. What are the Paralympics? Those are the Olympics for people who have disabilities. 
Well, there was a woman who won a bronze medal in the Paralympics as a snowboarder. And that woman lost her legs at the age of 19 from the knee down. So she used artificial legs, artificial legs to snowboard and she won a bronze medal at the Paralympics. You see, she told herself she could do it, and she did. It was remarkable. Now sometimes we're afraid to do things. We're afraid we're going to make a mistake, and that's natural. We've all been there. Well, I've made more mistakes than I can count. But that's okay, because if you take a risk, like Mr. Abdallah just said, if you take that risk and you fail, the worst that can happen is that you will learn from it. And the most successful people in this world are the ones who learn more from their mistakes than their successes. Every one of you today, every one of you graduates, is an individual with talents and contributions that no one else can offer. Nobody. And we need your special gifts. We need you to contribute to your full potential, whatever that may be. Yes, yes. And that can only happen if you continue to go to school, keep on learning all the way through college. You want to advance on that river. You don't want to fall back. We cannot afford to lose the talents of any one of you. And if you get to a bump in the road, don't give up. If you come to a bump, then just jump over it, right? I close today with just two thoughts. Graduates, you are the leaders of tomorrow. You are the leaders we are all waiting for in this world. And as Gandhi, the great leader from India, said, be the change you want to see in the world. So I want you all to sit back for a minute, close your eyes. I want you to visualize where are you going to be? What are you going to be in 20 years? Think about that. Do you want to be a teacher? Do you see yourself as a teacher? Do you see yourself as an astronaut, a nurse, a doctor, a car mechanic, a social worker? Do you see yourself starting a charter school 20 years from now? Well, today is a marvelous day to talk with your family about what it is you're thinking about 20 years from now. So please open your eyes and know that if you believe in yourselves, you will make your dreams happen, just like your school founders did. They realized their dream many years ago when they opened this charter school. So congratulations, graduates, and keep on rolling. Thank you very much, Senator Ember. As I told you before, Senator Ember, she was the architect of the charter school movement in 1991 when she was a senator in the House of, uh, in the Senate. So from today, you will learn that uh, Senator Ember, she was our keynote speaker. Thank you very much again, Senator Ember. And now I would like to welcome Sulaf, the eighth grade teacher. Welcome, Sulaf. On behalf of Rochester Math and Science Academy, it is my honor and a privilege to welcome our 2014 graduation. Students, along with their parents, principal, teachers, staff, distinguished guests, and attendees, we are here to celebrate the accomplishment of a great school year. It is has done my heart good to see these students develop and grow in the last year. The 2013-2014 school year has been filled with unforgettable memories that we will we'll all carry with us. Cherish those memories, but embrace your future. You will make a new cherished memories and make a wonderful friend along the way. As Martin Luther King Jr. once said, 
faith that faith is taking the first step even you don't see the whole staircase so take these first steps into your future it will be exciting before you go i would like to take a few minutes to recognize the dedication and passion of our great faculty and staff it is not coincident that your student performed better on test state test our students have access to the latest technologies and are encouraged to use them well our teachers are totally invested in the future of our student. Separate the world so other students can share in the success of our school. Parents, please keep your student focus. Their future depends on it. Student, whatever you do, do your best. Let us go and celebrate this day. Thanks. So now I'm going to call the student name to come up, do the speech. So the first name is Selwa Hassan. In the name of Allah, the beneficent, the most merciful, I start this day honoring the Almighty in His name. Bismillahir Rahmanir Rahim. Assalamu alaikum, my fellow two students, teachers, and guests. My name is Salwa Hassan. Former astronaut Ken Riley Jr. said, education is the key to success. Not only success, but pursuing our dreams, taking risks and beginning the journey of an experience of a lifetime. If we walk, we may stumble in obstacles in our way, but a person who believes themselves will surpass the finish line into success. I have not been here for long, but I've learned and experienced many things. Today is one of the very important days in our lives. Congratulations, eighth graders. High school is challenging and nothing like middle school. My speech not only talks about the paths we have opened, but also the opportunities in the world that we are capable of having within arm's length. Strengthen yourself with the lessons. Learn from it. Embrace it. Because the only way to be who you are all sums up to one code. Education is the key to success. And yet we always believed we can't do anything. We are incapable of anything. But there's always a person who will ask you to get to the top of the ladder just so they can see you fall down. And there's a person who beckons you to motivation and to reach your goal because it's not far away. The journey of a thousand miles begins with the first step. Nothing is impossible. Education is the key to success. High school is a long journey about to be taken. Think about it, four years, that's a long time. Successful people aren't gifted, they work hard and succeed on purpose. If you can dream it, you can do it. A teacher opens a hand, opens a mind, and touches the heart. Your teacher is like a pearl, value them. Rochester Math and Science Academy is a good school. There's nothing better than being in a safe, pleasant environment with the people that you know. 8K graduates, I'd like to wish you all a bright future with exceptional careers. We had some good times and bad times. Those times I'll never forget. But always remember, education is the key to success. I would like to thank my teachers, the support staff, my family, my friends, and most importantly, my parents, who gave me the opportunity to make a difference. Jazakallah, assalamu alaikum wa rahmatullahi wa barakatuh. Did you know that the hardest part of life for us, us eighth graders is actually right around the corner? It's high school. My name is Yasin Hassan. Welcome to the graduation for the class of 2014. I would like to thank the teachers, staffs, parents, students, and family members for participating in the graduation of this eighth grade class. Although today is a very special day for all of us, we will start from this day a new journey, a new journey that will open the road to the start of high school, while the rest of the journey will be very challenging. First, I would like to share a quote. John Gardner once said, True happiness involves the full use of one's powers and talents. 
Many of us don't know the power we have and, and the things we are able to change. What this quarter is trying to say is that we can make the world happy if we use our power and talent. I encourage my fellow classmates to be something good that is beneficial to this world. This school is a very good school. It was the first school I ever went to. If I go back nine years, I see myself in kindergarten, and today I see myself standing in front of you, leaving the school. If this school wasn't built, we mostly forgot our language, heritage, and religion. The reason why this school is so special is because it has everything we need in order to learn. They want us prepared for life. I would like to thank the people that work at this school for pushing us to where we are today, even though the power of education is unlimited. Theodore Roosevelt once said, a man who has never gone to school may steal from a freight car, but if he has university education, he may steal the whole railroad. Also, Kurt Vonnegut once said, true terror is waking up one morning and discovering that your high school class is running the country. I would like to say a piece of advice that would be useful to my fellow graduates. Remember that without education, you'll never be what you want. Try to never give up learning in your life. Also remember that your future lies in your hands. I want you to also remember our fun, happy, sad, and angry moments. I hope those memories are in your heart forever. Remember what John Gardner said, true happiness involves, involves the full use of one's powers and talents. So try to use what you have and what you learn to make your future a true happy life. I would like to thank the school for all their help making this day happen. I would also thank all of you who came to our graduation. Next student is Yasin Hassan. Assalamu alaikum and good afternoon. Members of faculty, friends, and family. My name is Aklas and I'd like to give everyone who has joined us today a warm welcome. Can you imagine that three years ago we were sixth graders and three years before that third graders? Fellow graduates, remember us being nervous of our first days at the school, wondering what was in store for us and how to survive it all. It has been a long ride coming this far, a journey. A journey to forever, a journey to forever treasure and devote ourselves to. My days here at Rochester Math and Science Academy have had its ups and downs, but surely the ups have outweighed the downs. Walking through these hallways today brought back all the memories that we shared, all the laughs, tears, and everything that lied in between. I stand in front of you today substantial and dignified, not fearing of what is ahead of me, because I am confident that this is not the end. I want to thank my family for raising me to be the person I have become today. And though it was not easy putting up with me all the time, you never for a second doubted my potential to do amazing things in life. I want to also thank the teachers and staff for being there for me and teaching me how to be an open-minded person. The Prophet Muhammad Sallallahu once said that the best of people are the ones who teach and the ones who are taught. Fellow graduates, the time we have is limited, so don't waste your life living someone else's dream. We all know that this is definitely not the end, unquestionably not the time we are going to give up. Although the past to our futures are still long and far. I want to thank everyone again for everything they have done to make my time here unforgettable and an experience I will never fail to remember. And to my fellow graduates, I wish us all bright and successful futures. Class of 2014, congratulations. The next student, Abdul Rahman Muhammad. So أعوذ بالله من الشيطان الرجيم بسم الله الرحمن الرحيم أنا جا أوه عبد الرحمن محمد وكم إذا أردت ذا مانتك خلنا نجيبين يس توصيل راتشستر ماتن ساس كاريمي وعفر حد هنا هل كان قصة لما ما عمل كسكول كه والدين ته معلمين ته أردت ذا يمرتك يمرتي شرفتك شو خبر شو ذن سلام تسلام كا سلام عليكم ورحمة الله وبركاته أنت كذب هدي أنا هي أردت ذا خلنا نجيبين يس أنت كذب هدي أنا هي أردت ذا خلنا نجيبين يس خلنا نجيبين يس سنة دوسيات كلا صد الله بقنا صد حتى الله بقنا عفردا فصل غسيد إعداد وحان كفر حسنا هنا ما أنت حفلة عن كروح ضبضا هنا لا هنا لا قبت يكون صحيح هنا خب كم ذا وحبر شدة أساسي جاء هرمرك آدا أنا أجنا جد بين متكل الدوسي سر وحان هي المام دون إن أبيت سري ونعكس ناد أي سكول كان الشقالة دي سبناد يارين وحنا نوبر إن جارهان ضخم كان يف كان هوي وحنا معمل كسكول كي والدين توحول بناه هري هرتو ذا كبر قادنا إن أنكل المرد على نوح برشدة ولا على الوحنا أجنه دبعت ذا قان لعند وكوب ستة أمت بدن أوانه لين فرشدة أنا كلام 
ولا عادي من قبك هندونا واجبات كان قصارا بلشدة يودنك سيان كل مقله وقعد دونا هرمرنت وحبرشدة هي نفت بلشدة انت هتكل واد ما سنتين Next student, Najma Muhammad. Assalamu alaikum. My name is Najma Muhammad and I'd like to welcome the families, staff, teachers, and fellow classmates. Today we are here to honor the ending of one chapter and to celebrate the beginning of a new one. As soon as we walk out of these doors, we are going to look back on the wonderful times here, I must say. As a class, we have all made memories we are always going to look back on, bad ones and good ones. I'll especially remember the fights, the cries, the laughs we have all made together as a class. Some of the memories will be forgotten and some will last in eternity. And Tall France once said, to accomplish great things, we must not only act, but also dream. Not only dream, but also believe. But I also think that we should not only believe, but also achieve. Not only achieve, but also succeed. Motivation and hard work leads to success, and that's what we all want, success. School isn't just about learning math, science, or English. It's also about learning life lessons. Life is like a novel. Every day is a new page, so enjoy it while you still can. I would like to thank my teachers, friends, my family, and most of all my parents for making me the best person I could possibly be. And I also want to thank you for guiding me throughout the way and the support you have gave me. It's not about taking the road traveled by, but it's more about the road less taken by. Middle school is all about YOLO, but in high school there will be no YOLO. Get prepared to be solo. But we still have to learn to forgive and forget, rather to never have forgiven or forgotten. Remember, life is short, so smile while you still can. But still, our future is ahead of us to find. Fellow graduates of 2014, we made it. Now, the next speech, Arabic speech, the students, Sarah Jilani and Abdullah Al-Umudi. Bismillahirrahmanirrahim. Alhamdulillahi Rabbil Alameen. Wa salatu wa salamu ala ashrafin anbiya wal mursaleen Sayyidina Muhammad wa ala alihi wa sahbihi ajma'in. وبعد مدير الفاضل يا ساتر المحترمين آبائي وأمهاتي العزاء إخواني وأخواتي الطلاب الطيوف الكرام أيها الحفل الكريم السلام عليكم ورحمة الله وبركاته في بداية هذا الحفل أود أن أقدم لكم الشكر والتقدير جميعا على مشاركتكم لنا حفلة خرجنا وإني أحيي بكم بروح المسؤولية التي لمسناها منكم الطوال الفترة التي قضيناها معا في هذه المدرسة التي ندين ونقر لها بالفضل ونكن لها بالتقدير التي تعلمنا منها مختلف المواد الدراسية المظلوبة بسم الله الرحمن الرحيم الحمد لله رب العالمين والصلاة والسلام على أشرف الأنبياء والمرسلين سيدنا محمد عليه وعلى آله وصحبه أفضل الصلاة والتسليم وبعد السلام عليكم ورحمة الله وبركاته نعم سنفترق بمشيئة الله وفي نفوسنا إرادات قوية للمواصى والتعليم ومهما كانت الصعوبات التي تواجهنا في أعوامنا القادمة فإننا على يقين أن النجاح سيكون حليفنا بإذن الله تعالى لأنكم زرعتم الثقة في أنفسنا وعودتمونا على مواجهة الصعاب ولا يفوتني بأن أقدم باسمي وباسم جميع زملائي الطلاب أسمى عبارات الشكر والعرفان لحضرة مدير المدرسة الفاضل والجميع الهيئة التدريسية من مرشد الطلاب والوكلاء والمعلمين ولجميع آبائنا وأمهاتنا الذين لم يدخروا أي جهد في توفير أسباب الراحة والجو المناسب لجميع مراحل الدراسيات السابقة جزاكم الله كل خير وعليكم السلام ورحمة الله وبركاته Last student, Sarah Darshan. 
Good afternoon, family, friends, faculty, and fellow graduates. My name is Sahar Dirsha, and welcome to the 2014 Washington Math Science Academy 8th grade graduation. I would like to thank my parents for their support and motivation, my teachers for giving me more knowledge throughout the year, the staff of Army State for being there when I needed them, and my friends for being there and being such great friends. Corey Ten Boom once said, memories are not key to the past, but to the future. There have been some good and bad memories, funny and some entertaining memories, but most of all, memories that can never be forgotten. These are the memories that remind you of the challenges you have faced, the challenges that have shaped your life, are shaped your life, or continue shaping you. These are the challenges that make you you. That's why you should always be yourself. Everyone else is already taken. You are born an original. Don't die a copy. I remember those first days of school, hoping your friends were still there, hoping for new faces to make new friends, and most of all, meeting new people to make new, long-lasting memories. When you find out that this could be achieved, you're overwhelmed with happiness, gratefulness. There are also those days when you felt like you couldn't go any farther, when you just want to give up. Remember, if you want to succeed, never quit, because quitting leads to failure. A very wise man and leader, Martin Luther King Jr. said, if you cannot fly, then run. If you cannot run, then walk. If you cannot walk, then crawl. But whatever you do, you have to keep moving forward. That's the piece of advice for everyone. As this door closes, another one opens, which means another adventure yet to start. We need to keep moving forward, open new doors, and do new things, because your careers and curiosity leads down new paths. Thank you, everyone, for your time. Thank you for support, advice, and motivation. We are here today graduating from eighth grade. Congratulations, congratulations. Sarah Gilani. <laughs> you, you have to stand up. You have to stand up. Can you stand up? Thank you so much. Go ahead. Yeah, give it to her. Abdurrahman Afi. Mustaf Hassan. <laughs> Abdul Rahman Omar. Abdul do you want to stand up to give you? Lul Sharif. It's okay, go. <laughs> Mohammed Hassan. A class Abdi. Congratulations. Oh. Faiso Noor. Najma Muhammad. <laughs> Muhammad Omar. Sahra Darsha. <laughs> Abdi Ismail.
Sumeya Ahmed. Dek Hassan. Mustafa Yusuf. Ahmed Ahmed. Firdosa Ali. Abdul Rahman Muhammad. Imran Bashir. <laughs> Salwa Hassan. <laughs> Khalid Abdullahi. Bahjaharshi Abdullah Moody Amina Araya. Yasin Hassan. Hani Haji. Marlabat. We have been so jaded. We are humble. We are humble. Eighth grade graduates, you made it. You made it. It's a fun day for us today. You are the graduates of 2014 from Rochester Math and Science Academy. Enjoy your time and be ready for the high school on September 2nd, 2014. Good luck and enjoy your time. Have a seat. Where it? The student that has the highest average score in science is Ferdosa Ali. <laughs> the student that has the highest average score in social studies is Sahra Darsha.
the student that has the highest score in average all subject is Lul Sharif. وأنا وحان سينا يا كلمة شيخ عبدي وربا إنو مدو وحان بالي ايو شيخ عبدي فالي تفضل قصو دو وحان الله وحاد وقال كان وحي الوصم ايو نيات سامي ويهر قلع ايا ان انتن مركي اللي بالله بها يدات قوبيو قكاء ها سيدان انا قصو قرد عايسو ويبعيسين هيا ارن قاد وحايا هاي اللو قدت ايو اركا هيا وحسو رجل كرابا انا انا حين دوكسي سومالي اي ما مشو Somali ule ya hai, takkan kita lugu dega hayo, diin ti lugu dega hayo, madi kita lugu dega hayo, atau Somali ay mamura iso, inu sura gele iso, dat kemarin kita juga ini moga. Nampak ni yara amra polis Palestin, aku ni yang ni latar sadean, ini house yang garam bayi go an sadean, ayo go kade ayo kuso kuso samayan mana polis wada, oh melu di yarsan anjirin, oh wahai kanan, hati amgarade wahai kaya kanan anjirin. يمزي أيك نوجي ماذا نأيه وقذا وطا قذا وطنا يا حجان كل عنا بيجي هذا قذا أنا أريان بارنا أنا دين دين جنة محجان كل قذا إني هذا بيجي هذا وقذا وقذا محد نقص وقاضي سانا وصدد من هذا مه مجهر وين تجي سمنه مركل قذا نقص وقاضنا إسان أنت نوعي ما تان واحد سلطان ما نقص سلطان قذا أنا نجي نوجي ديسان ما هي وحي ده هذين وحرمنا أنا أنا نو فتح جن نقنا أنفرنا هوش عن وصعم Guri gawara ayla hai, mahu ayai, hebat hebat nurak boleh kita. Guri ayla hai, dompet dia rok tu yang lewat yang kuka deh ini. Orang kata dia latak nai. Arin tiba ini asal bandi kaya. Mesra arin tika asal sertai. Mantu wahai mara isa ini high school lagi kalin jebi ay. Ini arur ti ay sedan isbat dia kan ay usamain hayan, ay Arab ku hamba hayan, Somali ku hamba hayan, Inggris ku ku hamba hayan. Even as a teacher, I can't tell you that getting straight A's guarantees that you'll have a success in life. Robert Frost is famous for his poem depicting a successful person taking a road less traveled. I would add to the amazing imagery of this poem and say that if you're traveling down a yellow wood, wouldn't a car with a GPS system uh, help out a lot? Education is that car for you, my former 8th graders. If you invest in your own education, you can tell that GPS to take you wherever you want to go. Having said that, I would like to thank everyone for coming and, and being with our 8th graders. And 8th graders, I'd like to tell you just a big good luck. <laughs> إسكول كانوا حسوم ولا لهم معلنوا حسابة مستر كيندي يبعنا بنت هذا حساب تلك الجوكتا حق ساينس كا وحسوم مرتين شن معلم بحسوم مرت طبعا كسنة وساينس كديجسي وحن إلهي مرخاتي كد إلى مين عزب يقول شيء جيا وان معلمين تي أرض ذي ولد المرخاتي كسنة جيا إن قبل ده صوم معلم ده معلم ده أقول يا إسكول كا ساينس كديجتا إن النقطة معلم ده أقول وأنا أكثر إسكول كا محايل قبل ده معلم ده وحي سكول كم علمين تكعدهم بيسا سبع ساعة إلا أفرسا عيد وديارنا سا عشر كبير دقيقة هيد أنا أقول بهذا سكول وحن ويدي جبر يرون أذار وهاي سكول كديك تان ويدي ما حد معلمة دخل جعلاته أنا ديش عبد غادر هو مش شيء ما مكر هو مش شيء وحتى مرك جلاس كسوق الشو وحكى هذا الشا أدوق وحكى دعي نوش شكتا مراكي وحكى دعي نوش شكتا من الصور وحكى دعي نوش شكتا فرشات ربي نوش شكتا وحتى كو جرنا سا أردت أن أجعل هذه المعلمة داسي وأسيدة وحبرته وحان إذا كانت سنة إنها إنها نوشة غالية سنة أردت أن أجعل هذه المعلمة داسي وأسيدة وحبرته
if you 